hi, I'm Michael McCool, and we're here at IDF Shenzhen 2016. And I'm actually running a robotics lab uh, using the recently announced uh, Intel RealSense Robotics Development Kit. The Robotics Development Kit actually consists of two pieces, the, uh, a RealSense uh, R200 camera and a, uh, an upboard uh, which uh, can interface to it and, uh, and drive, the, uh, drive the camera. So that's, this is the actual kit. Now what I have here in the lab is a robot that's based on the kit, uh, that is using it internally. And uh, let me just turn this around here. A little hard to see, but inside this, uh, this robot is an upboard that is driving it. So the upboard is actually quite a powerful computer. Uh, it's running a quad-core atom processor uh, that can uh, turbo up to 1.9 gigahertz per core. So um, that allows it to run uh, very compute-intensive workloads, uh, including the robot operating system, including the full robotic navigation. So this is actually a fully autonomous robot. It can scan its environment, build a map, and then use that map to navigate around an environment. So this, the upboard um, actually has a quad-core uh, Atom X5 processor on it uh, that is actually uh, quite powerful. Uh, you can also see it's got a form factor that's compatible with the Raspberry Pi, so you can use it in projects that uh, Raspberry Pi fits into, ports from the same location. The one difference from Raspberry Pi, or, or one of the main differences, is the addition of a USB 3 port here. Uh, this is actually an on-the-go port, but this port uh, allows you to interface to the RealSense camera. Um, but uh, it also uh, supports uh, interface uh, pins, which can be used to drive uh, various uh, devices uh, and, and sensors. Um, it's got an integrated uh, heatsink. Uh, one of the interesting things about the uh, Atom X5 is it can turbo up to a, a very high clock rates, but to get the access to those clock rates, you have to cool it efficiently. So this provides a, a good cooling solution. Uh, the board also has onboard storage. So you'll notice there's no SD card slot because it actually has integrated uh, flash memory on board, multiple gigabytes of flash memory, as well as multiple gigabytes of RAM. The, uh, the new upboard is part of the Intel Robotics uh, development kit, also including an R200 camera. The entire kit, the R200 plus the upboard, will be available for $249 uh, soon. Um, I'm also, this particular robot, which is based on the, up, on the upboard, is actually a project with the uh, Intel University Program Office. We're currently doing pilots for the entire system for education. Uh, we actually expect this board to be useful for all kinds of projects, robotics and non-robotics. Uh, it's actually a very interesting board in general for IoT projects.